Hey, everyone. So I'm gonna continue with Spyro. It's been a minute since I played it, since you guys seen it. Um, but I just want to say right quick, thank you for all those who liked the video. It, it gives me a better perspective on what you guys actually like to see on this channel. So since you guys liked it, I'm going to continue. <laughs> So where should I go next? <laughs> and I promise you, no, no weird stories this time. No, no, no Timmy, Tommy, t Kimmy. Why am I just mentioning Nickelodeon characters? <laughs> but anyway, let's get going. <laughs> I've been mean. Oof. <laughs> to play more Spyro, I really love this game. Best deal of my damn life. <laughs> uh, I'm going to Square Town. Oh, the memories. Oh gosh, these derpy ass chickens. <laughs> Also, just to give you guys an update about that last place. The reason why I, I'm not sure if I set this in the video or not, because I have a habit of not looking at my videos after I edit them. Welcome to Town Square, Spyro. Begin exploring by gliding to that area with the bull. Use the L2 and R2 buttons to get a good look. Okay. <laughs> but, um... I... Did not... Miss a gem. It turns out that was 100% and I was just a crazy person. Oh, I remember being so afraid of these bulls. <laughs> I didn't even know back then I could charge them. But I guess maybe they thought we would do that because we have horns, they have horns. So be it. <laughs> oh. I, I gotta bring that up in a minute, but... <laughs> Don't worry about it. The only thing that hurts him now is his dignity. <laughs> But the whole reason why I didn't know that I could charge them... I think when I was younger... Oh, I just remember. When I was younger... I think I went to... Was it called Sleepy Hollow, that stage? That stage in the maze, and the one dragon was like, you can't... Charge things that are bigger than you and I automatically assumed that the the bulls were bigger than me So I never even knew about that Yeah, actually <laughs> Yeah, the truth be told, I didn't know about that until the Reunite Trilogy came out. Oh god, can you stop norking? I'm just gonna leave the bull like that. <laughs> but, yeah, the, the more you know, I guess. Oh no, did he disappear? I guess he did. I heard the foofs. <laughs> I think in trilogy, the reunite trilogy now, if you do that and you leave them like that, they just kind of stay there. What's... But... They, they don't really do that here. I'm pretty sure that has something to do with, um, the limitations 
Oh, you sneaky bastard. Get out of here. Cork it. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's, that's, those are just little things here and there. Uh, I thought they disappeared the further you went away, but I guess not. Okay. All right, Dad. Don't get so upset. We can't take you to the hospital right now. <laughs> it's kind of far. Um, if I'm not mistaken, he's over here. Let me see if I still got it. Yep. Come on. Didn't even make it that far. That was. That was pretty sad. But if you ask younger me, I, I I was doing this for way longer maybe than I should. I didn't think of flaming them. I was the insane child that whenever I saw the thieves, I always charged after them. Like some type of a lunatic. As you saw, just flaming them and doing that is a whole lot easier than coming to this point and you have to go back up there again and again. That was probably like the easiest got egg I have ever got in this game. I have no plans to die today. Thank you for releasing me. Ah. Uh -huh. You're welcome. Uh... Dragon Dad... Which Dragon Dad are we on? My 12th Dragon Dad. That's what- that's what that is. <laughs> I think I'm good. I think I got everything. Uh, wait, what? I'm missing a red gem somewhere. How did that happen? Uh, give me a second. We're, we're not gonna spend all our time on that again. Oh, guys, somehow I missed this one way at the beginning. Huh. Someone must have either noticed or were just like base bombing. Like, oh no, it's gonna happen again. <laughs> it's okay, I have it. And it didn't take me nearly as long because the same theme is playing. <laughs> yeah, let's get out of here and go to the next place. Wouldn't that be sad if I left and then I came back after being in the game and it was right there? <laughs> uh, I think I want to go... Was it called Sleepy Hollow? Am I, am I just making stuff up in my head? Um... Oh, Dark Hollow. He's lucky. I think I'm getting confused with the book. Yeah, but I, I like this place too. Hmm. Uh, there's, there's a lot of edits. I, I think I forgot to say it. But you notice the bull has blood on his horns. And these guys have, like, blood on their freaking daggers. It was a different time. They don't do that now. They got rid of it. They cleaned it. Um. <laughs> uh. 
but it's okay, I guess. It, it, it's not gonna make or break my experience. But I did like those little details, you, you know? They will stab if necessary. I don't know what they were stabbing, maybe some tomatoes. Oh, it's you. I wasn't sure if you'd escape those annoying little creatures. Of course, they wouldn't bother me, but here's a hint. Metal armor is fireproof, but a charge attack will take care of it. I notice. <laughs> I just want to say something else about these games, particularly the Spyro ones, at least in my current years of life. Um, for those of you who don't know, I haven't met my bio. I am like an artist. I'm a fine artist. Let me meet the chunky boy down here. <laughs> and this game inspired me so much. Hey! Hey. <laughs> he doesn't really hurt you. He just says that. <laughs> but this game... Um... The look, the feel, the music, the butt. Yeah, I see you got metal armor. It means nothing to me. <laughs> this whole thing today inspired me artistically. I think it always did. It inspired me to. Uh, I guess more like inspired. More like influence, I think. It had some influences in how I make fantasy art and how I make some of my pieces. Um, I guess I'll put in one of my art pieces right here. And for those of you who don't know, uh, I don't work digitally, I work traditionally. I like working with oil paints and watercolors, that that type of thing. I used to make comic books and whatnot, but I was more of a fine artist, so I took that path. Spyro, want to know a secret? Use the triangle button when you want to zoom in and look around. Oh, your secret's safe with me. I'm gonna tell everybody! <laughs> eh, I don't need to save. I think particularly Wizard Peaks. Um, and I think... What was that place? Wizard Peaks and... This in general, the Dreamweaver world. I love those places. I love, love, love it. Um, it greatly influenced it. I also used to write a lot and I would listen to the music and see how that made me feel. Whether that's cringe or not, I don't know. Probably some professional out there is like, No, it's not cringe, that's how I work every day. That'd be for reals though. <laughs> music inspires and makes us feel a ton of different stuff. Why? I don't know. It's a science. It's a science. Hey. <laughs> you don't play with your food. <laughs> but um it, I think this was part of the reason why I became an artist. I'm not sure if this video is going up before the other video. I'm, I might have mentioned it. Um, but this game didn't make me become artist. That 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 whole site to another game. But I owe a lot of what I do today thanks to like devs and musicians and just them sharing their talents. And I always. Like, really appreciate it. We... <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Big enemies like this Gnork with the club cannot be charged. 
but a quick flame. That should defeat them. Why are you telling me this at the end of the level, dude? <laughs> How many of them have I killed? I guess this is the spirit of kids that couldn't read the manual. I read the manuals, kinda. I was terrible at reading back then. Ooh. Wait a minute. I'm not doing that. Wee. <laughs> eh. I don't think I ever took the stairs. I just always free balled right into that guy. Let me see. I, how many other freaking devs do I own? Like things and stuff that I create too. Guilty Gear was like a big influence for one. Most definitely. Uh, how many of these things I have got left? Oh shoot, I am lacking. Wait, I didn't even get all the home gems? Huh. Just realize. Oh yeah, it's because I I didn't open the chest, duh. I mean, it's not all of it, but... <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I think that's really the main main thing I want to share. I just uh I just seriously love these old well not just old. Some of them are still going on today, like Spiral. When that new game coming out, I want it. Sorry. Oh. I'm so silly. It's all up here. See, this is why I edit this stuff out. <laughs> you guys would be here with me just <laughs> doing like weird, weird things. You don't want to see that. Hmm. I think that's like all the, like the basic levels. Question is, do I go to Toasty or do I go to the flying area? <laughs> hmm. That's weird. Is this because... Did it not stay because I didn't go in there? That doesn't make sense. I never... Knew that could happen. I'm gonna test that theory. I'm going to Toasty. Now, those of you who never played Spyro before... In the original game, there are these bosses that kind of just exist in the level. It just should open now. Yep. <laughs> and, it, and let's listen to this dragon again. He actually has different dialogue once you unlocked it. Cool flash. Do that again. The artisan boss has put a portal behind me. You can challenge him now. If you feel you are ready. Sure. What's the worst that can happen? I'm pretty sure I won't die by some unexpected means. Let's go. <laughs> After like doing this, is this like such a step up? Do I want to attempt doing this? Th those of you who played this game, have any of you used like the dodge mechanic before? I never did. I just always ran away. I'm gonna attempt it, but I'm probably gonna hate it. 
if I don't just go back to my old instincts of ah, uh, it's about to smack me. <laughs> oh, yeah, those dogs, those freaking dogs, man. You'll see what I mean. Oh, maybe I should have done that. <laughs> Made my life so much easier. Wait. Let me take a look see here. Planning it out. Oh, this is a bad angle. I want this dog. Well, do I want that dog? Nah. Nah, it's going pretty. Probably be better. And then get rid of you. I don't know why you do that. <laughs> Maybe I sh Yeah, I probably should have been using that. It, it seems like it's a lot easier than just charge away. Because you have like a, a risk of getting smacked. Let me try it the old method. Oh gosh. Yeah, uh, and I never tried charging these guys. I'm gonna assume that you cannot charge the the dogs, cause they're they're two hits. Yeah. Oh, why I go that way? My joystick. Well, not the joystick, but my analog is just decided that I wanted to go that way. What? Nope. This is slowly becoming like the saddest battle in the whole game. What the heck? I usually always get smacked once with my old method. Now I know the the effective method. Uh, <laughs> I'll get my dragon dad out of there in a second. I gotta go through here. I think this is gonna... Ugh. I think there's like a dog in a very inconvenient spot. Yep. Ugh. Thanks, dog. Yeah, this is... This is... Ugh. Yeah, I, this is... I've been doing this all wrong. I just realized this. Nasty Nork has put one of his most devious henchmen in charge of the artisan world. Bring him on. I think I smell a barbecue. <sighs> Careful, Spyro. This bomb has many tricks up his sleeve. Yeah, I think... <laughs> first... Baby Spiral is not my favorite Spiral. <laughs> he, he has that 90s tooth about him. Look, it's toasty. Look how big and scary he is. Oh god, what am I gonna do? I'm this baby dragon. Uh, 
You didn't see that, guys. He, he's totally scary. Two dogs. Okay, okay. <laughs> you didn't see that. You didn't see that. <laughs> Listen, Toasty is the most OP boss in existence. You do not underestimate Toast. <laughs> oh gosh, Toasty. I guess we're done with that. You know what? Guys. I'm gonna call the video right about here. <laughs> but if you want me to continue, like I said, leave this video a like. And also feel free to share it, cause I I, I kind of exist in the ether. And oh yeah, it totally closes when you don't go in there. I never knew that. <laughs> but yeah, leave a like, please, so I I know that you actually like the content. And also feel free to chat it up with me in the comments below, cause I I be lurking. But next time we're going into the bonus stage but until then or you want to see more of this please don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you all next time bye bye for now matane